This may be the beginning of a long record. It's about an hour after the facility suffered the explosion that triggered the emergency lockdown. Just finished helping the dock officer set up the transmission relay. Not much signal strength, but it's better than nothing. 
The transmission gives the code to open the turbo lift when or if help arrives. Code is a simple group of five numbers. Three, 17, 13, then the next two numbers are... Sir, couldn't we contact the med bay? Maybe the Jedi's awake. If so, she could help us. No good. The link to the medical computer was severed from the hub, just like the administration console. Even if the Jedi wakes up, how would we get the dormitory turbo lift code to her? Without it, the turbo lift to the administration level is locked down. We just took an inventory of our supplies. We've got enough emergency rations in the dormitories to last almost a month. But with all the problems in the facility, I don't know how long we'll last. I wish we could contact the Jedi. Maybe she could... No. She's still floating in that damn tank. Someone's played us for fools. And since Corda and his crew aren't locked in here with us, it's pretty clear who it was. If I ever catch up with that Mandalorian loving son of a... At least the air scrubbers are still working, even though they're tied into the... Hey. What's happening to the ventilation system? It's... to get to the dormitories. We should be safe here. We've been trying to use the holo transmitter to beam a transmission to the administration level to end the lockdown. But the administration console has been severed from the main hub. Everyone thinks we should try to evacuate on our own as soon as possible. But there's no way to break the dormitory seals from the inside. I'm going to keep sending distress calls in the meantime. We've been trying to find a way to circumvent the lockdown and get to our hangar bay, but so far, no luck. <sighs> the situation's worse than we thought. Even if we get out of here, we can't shut down the fuel depot force fields if a fuel leak was detected. If so, the only way off this asteroid is if a ship docks with us. But the only connection to the docking platform is on the administration level, and we can't get up to the docking bay while we're trapped here. I only hope someone survived the explosion in the mining tunnels. If not, then we're stranded here. Unless our transmission reaches a passing ship, or a Telos freighter. Managed to use the holo transmitter here as a crude relay to beam short burst transmissions outside the Paragas facility. With any luck, the transmission will carry beyond the asteroid field. We've set the emergency transmission on automatic playback. We're using a simple military flash code to transmit the code to the turbo lifts, so maybe our rescuers can get down to the dormitory when they reach the station. Without those turbo lift codes, our rescuers wouldn't be able to get here from the administration level. And without those codes, we wouldn't be able to get to the administration level if we found a way out on our own. The messages are short distress calls only, since we can't get much signal strength. It's pretty weak, so unless a ship is actively searching the area, it might be a long time before a ship picks up the message. After all, who would be scouring frequencies way out here looking for trouble? Managed to use the holo transmitter. We've without have the transmission gives the code to open the turbo lift when or if help arrives. Code is. The transmission gives the code to open the turbo lift when or if help arrives. Code is a simple group of five numbers. Three, 17, 13, then the next two numbers are... Thank <laughs> you. 
Get out of the dormitory section before the lockdown, you murglack. You're cutting a little close, aren't you? Yes. A regrettable miscalculation on my part. 
I'm contacting you because I'm picking up a subspace transmission from within that level. Is that your doing? No, they, they must be trying to use the old relay system to send an emergency signal. I doubt they know what's really going on. Hey, this turbo lift's locked down. Try the code again, and don't worry about the miners and their transmission. By the time help arrives, we'll be all the way to Narshada. Oh, they won't be leaving the dormitories. The explosion within the tunnel has damaged the ventilation systems, causing breaches in the core exhaust conduits. What? That's going to kill them all! Not all of them, but I'm sending a number of mining droids to your location right now to correct that problem. Kurda, this turbo lift's locked down. The sequence isn't working. Keep trying it! You! Why are you doing this? Why me? You. It was never about you. The Jedi is all that interests me. But then you had to ruin everything by revealing her identity and then trying to harm her. And that I cannot allow. Statement. You are a risk, Corda. You are impulsive, crude, and soon deceased. <laughs> Query. Corta, Corta, are you dead yet? Smug statement. I believe I forgot to mention that I reversed the turbo lift codes. In case you managed to get this far. Homes didn't make it. Yes. Hey, try oh, what? Not a court. Keep you, but then stay. Mocking query. Corta, Corta, are you dead yet? Smug statement. I believe I forgot to mention that I reversed the turbo lift codes. In case you manage to get this far. I have felt a disturbance. Our enemy is here. We must leave at once. We need to make our way to the docking area on this level. I fear the airlock has already opened, and if so, we must be on our guard. If we cannot reach the Ebon Hawk, then we must find a way to escape on the ship that has docked here.
What in space is going on? Who's this? Another Jedi? What, did you guys suddenly start breeding when I wasn't looking? Uh, alright. I'm guessing that Republic ship that just docked isn't carrying friends of yours. I hope your talent for understatement is offset by your skill with a blaster. If not, then I fear our time together will be short indeed. Yeah, and I'm also good at running and drinking, your majesty. And even if you two aren't big friends of the Republic, that warship's the only way off this station. Good thing we have a clear run to the ship. Threat. Master, perhaps I did not enunciate clearly the last time we spoke. I suggested that you should shut down, stay put, and wait for rescue. Correction. I am not here to argue semantics, Master, so I will simply inform you that you are wrong, as were those recently corrected miners. Clarification. Assassin and droid is such a crude term, Master. Preserved for Durasteel drones uploaded with only the most archaic kill programs. The function I perform has been referred to as wanton slaughter. I prefer to see it as a means of facilitating communication, resulting in the termination of hostilities. Correction. I am... Resignation. Very...
Something is wrong. I sense no one on board. You sense no one on board? Sense any assassin droids creeping up behind us like last time? Everyone here has been slain, yet there are few signs of battle. No carbon scoring, no blast of fire. This place has been hit by assassins of a different sort. Then what are we doing on this ship? We were better off in the facility. You two are supposed to be Jedi? You two are the worst Jedi I've ever met. We cannot go back into the facility. If the assassin machine was correct, then we cannot reach the hangar. Be silent. I need some time to think. Look, I don't mean to cast another shadow on this, but even if you could reach the ship you came in on, it wouldn't matter. You'll need the orbital drift charts to clear the Paragus asteroid field, unless you want to have the shortest flight out of Paragus ever recorded. Well, of course they have the asteroid drift charts in their Navi computer. They'd have to. Well, we'd have to get to the bridge. I mean, well, that's the biggest problem I can see. That is a sound plan for the moment. Let us go. Our enemies... All right. But the...
we've been diverted from Onderon to the Outer Rim. There's not enough ships out there, and we're already hard-pressed to keep patrolling the regions under our jurisdiction. I'm afraid we're going to lose it all. There's just not enough ships and too much territory to cover. We're still rebuilding from the war with Malak, and sometimes I wonder if we'll ever recover. Still, we have our orders. As ordered, we've picked up the passengers from the Outer Rim and have made quarters for them. We expect to arrive within 10 standard days, provided there's no miss. I have some reservations about turning the heart, whoever this passenger is. We picked up a distress signal. We have also transmitted the damaged vessel. There is no match for the We'll only know for sure when we are. taken on passengers to Telos. Sir, we've just received an emergency broadcast. A freighter under attack by Sith forces. Can you get an ID on the ship? Yes, sir. We have its ID signature. It's not in our databanks, but its profile suggests some low-stock freighter. It says it's being hit hard by a Sith warship. Sir? I'll need to confirm with command before we move to intercept. Report. The Sith warship is empty, sir. There's no one on board? They're still in their berth, sir. Then who was fi- We don't know, sir. Did you still want a tractor beam? Search the freighter and the warship. Yes, sir. <laughs> Let's <laughs> go. 
Are you all right? We do not have much time. Whatever you intend to do, do it quickly. Thank <laughs> you. 
checking the survivor from the Sith vessel. I'm his flesh is cracked and scarred. Judging from the scar tissue, something's wrong. Ever since we picked up that Sith, the strange thing is, I keep feeling like someone's watching us. This is the medical officer. The soldiers into the medical bay have just... With him are Sith. I think they were all... I have no idea how many are on the ship. There could be a... I think that thing in the tank was a Sith Lord. A... Something's wrong. Something's... Something... This... a bad feeling about this. Don't you feel it? Something's gonna get real wrong real quick. All right, but don't say I didn't warn you. Trust me, when it comes to staying alive, I'm rarely wrong about these things. This battle is mine alone. I am not defenseless. He cannot kill what he cannot see, and power has blinded him long ago. Run! I shall be along shortly.
Tell me you're joking. We are not going to cross back into the Paragas facility through the fuel line. That's crazy. All right, but I know I'm going to regret this. I sent you, my master. Faint. Weak. Your senses betray you, as you betrayed me. After all that's happened, still you live. You are difficult to kill. For one as limited as you. Perhaps. To have fallen so far and learned nothing, that is your failing. The failure is yours. No longer do your whispers crawl within my skull. No longer do I suffer beneath teachings that weaken us. And now you run in search of the Jedi. They are all dead, save one. And one broken Jedi cannot stop the darkness that is to come. Perhaps we shall see. What's wrong? Are you all right? Damn it, hold on. It's only a little farther. What happened to you? You look fine. Come on. We need to keep moving. It's a utility droid. Looks like it's been hit with an ion. Thank <laughs> you. 